was posted to this school. Initially, they used to practice the hand washing, but it wasn't severe as compared to now. Yes, because um, we weren't having enough facilities, but thanks to WhatsApp, they've been able to provide us with facilities and things that would help us practice the hand washing effectively. So ever since we came, the hand washing has been very, very effective ever since. And education and also demonstrations that has been delivered to the children has also helped them to practice it effectively. Here in the deaf school, they learn through demonstration. So because hand washing was involved with demonstration and practice, it really helped them to learn fast with how to wash their hands properly to prevent them from contracting the virus. As a hand washing chief education officer, my responsibility is help my class members to be able to wash their hands whenever it's time for them to go for breakfast. They will be in a queue and also they will be washing their hands one by one. Those who are not able to do it, I will guide them to be able to do it properly. Afterwards, we will continue when school closes and everything that they do in the school. I'll guide them to wash their hands properly. Thank you. In terms of personal hygiene, it's helping. It's helping us as a person. It's helping us as a community. And it's helping us as a country. So you come in on board is in place. And I will encourage that, just as you are forming ambassadors, when you came, you had teachers as ambassadors, you had students as ambassadors. Just as you have them, do also be encouraging the other people. Water and sanitation for the urban poor, I think that has been a great, great, great support. Especially when you talk about special schools. For, for me, I always say that, I mean, special schools are kind of being left behind all the time and so, if you look at the backgrounds, many of them come from very deprived backgrounds and pay the kinds of disabilities they have and the multiples that come in and all of that, the way they act and all of that. I think that when these basic things are provided with a bit of instruction and all of it, they'll be able to get it sorted out. So we are extremely grateful to them. I mean, it's one huge relief that is going to go a long way to help the school and the children as well. So we are grateful.